and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today it is 8 p.m. on Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving to all of you guys. Hopefully, you guys have all eaten your dinner already. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it, had some great time with the family. But I had to go take a break. If you guys hear them in the background, I'm sorry. They're all here right now, so you might hear some noise in the background. Disregard all of that, guys. The Blitz promo is officially here. I gotta show you guys everything that's come out. Obviously, we know about the Blitz bolts already. We got the two masters, as you guys probably see from the title already. We got Lamar Jackson and Chris Johnson, 94 overall. These cards are gonna be absolutely insane. I'm gonna go over all this in the video, go over the sets, the solos packs i'm gonna go over everything so stay tuned for all that guys i have all this in store during this video for you guys hopefully you guys pop out to this video and show some support i'm stepping away from the family to get this out to you guys so all you got to do is just return with support now guys if you are new to the channel make sure you're going below hit that subscribe button turn that noti bell boys we're almost at 13 almost at 13.2k already we're going crazy fast if any, at this rate we're going to be hitting like 14k in a few days so guys keep smashing the like button keep smashing the comp button guys can we get 500 likes in this video you guys earlier i challenged you guys to get as many likes as you could on the content videos you guys killed it can we get half a thousand likes 500 likes on this eight o'clock video on thanksgiving if you guys want to show us some happy thanksgiving some some love to the channel smash that like button boys if you're starting right now you'll probably hit it so everyone watch right now smash the sub button the like button and comment down below what you think of these sets and all these masters and everything that we see in this blitz promo now let's go over to what we know first so let's come over to this uh to my binder actually real quick the rookie premier cards did upgrade so if you guys do have any of the rookie premier cards such as kyler murray that did get a uh, 90 overall you can see right here kyler murray he has a 90 speed 89 throw power 85 throw short 82 throw mid 85 throw deep 80 throw under pressure 91 throw on the run and 78 play action now his agility is an 89 his acceleration is 91 let's see what he's got going for his juke and some ball carry vision is a 90 his spin and juke are decent at best nothing too great there but let's see if he, what abilities he can get on this card because that is going to make or break this card let's add the ability upgrade slot so cams he can obviously get the times two cams now and he cannot get escape artist so that is kind of an l yeah it's kind of a big l right there he cannot get escape artist he can get agile extender i mean he can't get any of these things all the cool stuff he can't get for him to get escape artist let's see what he would actually need to get to where's escape artist here can he not, does he not even get the ability to get, to get it? Or my 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 blind. Okay, right there, escape artist. He needs 99 overall, so he will not be probably getting escape artist this entire year. I doubt a rookie premier card is going to get a 99 overall at all this year, even if he gets rookie player of the year, which at that point I don't even think he'd still get it because it's usually like a 98. But let's head over to the set to show you guys the brand new masters. So first right here we got Blitz, two sets. We got Chris Johnson and Lamar Jackson. Now Chris Johnson does cost 25 more master tickets than. Lamar Jackson does. They both expire December 9th at 10 a.m. So you have quite a while to do these. Now, Lamar Jackson is 93. My bad if I saw him 94. And then Chris Johnson is 94. This Chris Johnson is going to be crazy fast. Now, it kind of upsets me that we, you know, we check all these new running backs and they drop a Chris. Because if Chris is faster than Barry, it's going to be kind of upset. Now, these miss, these master tickets, guys, just like I explained in my other videos, like the CDs. So you're going to probably use Blitz Bolts and all that stuff to get the other Blitz players. And probably in return, you'll get, ma you'll get master tickets that you can use. So these master tickets, that's quite a lot. 150 and 125 are going to be quite expensive to get. 125, 150. So I expect that these cards will be quite expensive. Let's go check the block real quick, see if any of them are up. I know things are slowly getting updated into the game right now. I don't think the store actually has the packs yet. It does not. But let's go see the store real quick and see if anyone has any of these cards. I wonder if they're in packs yet or if the sets are just out. So let's head on over. I was checking Jalen Smith earlier to see if his power up will go up after he announced that, you know, they announced to get a card. So let me check this real quick. Do they have the Blitz filter in yet? Yes, they do. There's nothing up. So guys, so I got the Blitz Welcome Pack. So obviously everything is now in game. 100 Blitz Bolts, 82 overall Chris Johnson, which you can sell for 100 training, but still an 84 speed on an 82 card is not horrible. Let's quick sell this for some Blitz Bolts here. Let's get that. Now that everything's in the game, we got Blitz Flash Pack number one. What is this? So explore much to see what special challenges are available. Log in between 4 a.m. and 12 p.m. to earn your next Blitz Flash Pack. So there's like a daily login pack. You should have logged in between certain hours and you get all of it. That is not valuable. So that is our first one that we did get. So let's see what's available now. So we go over to this, uh, over here. Is there anything for Blitz regarding this? Nothing. So let's go over to the season. So there should be a house rule out at this point. I know that was definitely a part of it. I wonder if that's dropped yet. No. So it has not dropped yet here. So let's go check the solos because I know that they were going to do a online and an offline house rule. So in their time. So maybe the online has not dropped yet. Let's go back in. Now Randall Cunningham kind of looked like Will Smith from Fresh Prince of Bel Air for a second. Really threw me off. All right. So let's go to play challenges. Let's see, are the Blitz solos in the game? And they should be somewhere up here. And they are not, of course, go figure. So the, the content is, of course, delayed as per usual. 
But the store has updated with all the stuff. So we, as we can see, we got a 100 Blitz Bolt Pack for 500 coins. Don't mind if I do, that's probably worth it. I do see some special offers there. And I see Theme Diamond. Ooh, that's a cool, that's a pretty cool animation. Looks like a little flat, a little spray paint right there. Let's see what we got going. So we got multiple, a Theme Diamond Fantasy Bundle, 10 minute door buster. So we have this for 10 minutes. Unlocks at 12, oh, are all the offers, are they showing us all the offers? That'll be available. Wow, because there's no global limit, there's gonna be, okay, that's cool. So we get to see every pack available. So because there's no global limit this year, they're not surprising us. We're going to know every offer that comes out. So at 12 a.m., which is tonight, it's going to be a Theme Diamonds Fantasy Pack. 500 for 5 bucks, you get to get a one Theme Diamond player. A Superstar Blitz Bundle. Plus, you get the uh, Blitz Bolts, obviously. So it looks like the Blitz Bolts you get is per dollar spent. So that kind of sucks. I mean, it's kind of going to... Kind of ridiculous. So we get the Elite All Pro Blitz Bundle, 24 times Gridiron Bundle, Mutt Heroes Blitz Bundle. So now we're still on November 30th, Legend Blitz Bundle. So, so far, the only ones I'm liking so far is none of these I'm really liking so far, to be quite honest with you. Maybe the kickoff one, only because you get that kickoff player that are crazy expensive. Right here, Legend Blitz Bundle, we get four fantasy packs, Legend Fantasy Packs, full Legend. That one's decent, kind of like a regular bundle. Slightly better than a regular bundle. This one, 20 bucks for a free NFL Centennial Pack. Probably worth it if you do get a full, full one, right? And now we get a most fear blitz bundle not worth it gonna be honest with you guys i do not think that the themed bundles, seasonal bundles are ever worth it to begin with so they are especially not worth it when it comes at the cost of like 50 bucks a team of the week blitz bundle decent this one right here series redux fantasy bundle is isn't a bad 10 bucks that's what we paid pretty we paid more than that i think for our level like 70 pack so i think that's a pretty good one right there harvest blitz bundle we get a harvest fantasy pack harvest packs uh enough to make some players that one's decent because we are dirty doing that. 50 bucks for four game changer bundle, a clutch, a flashback, a heavyweight, and a veteran. This one's decent. It's kind of like a variety pack opening. And then a blitz uniform for a thousand, which is actually available now. Now, can we get cams? If, if I knew we can get cams, then I'd take it. But we do get a thousand blitz bolts from that now. To get the actual blitz master CDs, we have to figure out how you do that. The actual bundle, though, is like about 50 bucks total if you have EA access. And that's going on for four days. You get. Yeah, you get 2,300 2, Blitz Bolts Quicksell. So it appears that the way you get the Master Tokens are not through any of this. So let's see, we got Blitz Bolts players, 87 Chase Vinovich. So you, oh, so you get the players by using Blitz Bolts. That's exactly how you get it. And you get Master Tickets. So you have to actually use Blitz Bolts to get them. So the conversion ratio appears to be, it's looking like half. Um, well, half minus zero. So it's looking like for every 100, for every 200, you get like one Master Ticket. So that's going to cost quite a bit. Let me do some quick math there. I don't know if that's the exact conversion, but it's looking like that. So he costs 1,200. So that's actually not that bad. If you get your free 600 plus your house, you can get a free Chase Vinovich. Let's see. He costs 3,100. He costs... It doesn't even show. It doesn't show. All these are kind of lagging out here. Let's see. Here's the best one. All the way to the bottom. Let's see what we're rocking with here. Okay, so we got... 89 Trey Waynes, 91 Robbie Anderson, 88 Montez Sweat, 80, 91 Jalen Smith, 91 Josh Allen, 88 Marcus Hunt, 88 Burita, 90 Kyler Murray, 87 Josh Jonathan Abraham, 90 over Bryce Callahan. Now let's go back to the back because I kind of started from a weird spot. 92 Lane Johnson. Okay, that sucks because I've had a Lane Johnson card all year. I've been wanting an upgrade. He goes for 6,000. That's really not that horrible. And you get back 33 master tickets. And these unlock daily also. So that's why they're not available. So I'll go over who's available right now. Jerome Baker, 89 overall. 92 overall, Justin Reed. 89 overall, DK Metcalf. And 92 overall, Dalvin Cook. Now these are going to be the last ones right here that release on 12-2. So let's go over to the beginning and see the first ones that release. So as of today, we can only get Mark Andrews or Chase Vinovich. And they seem like they come in packages like 87, 90, 87, 90, 88, 91. It goes up. So within three intervals there, not bad. Now Blitz Bolts packs. So, so guys, pretty much this year, they're letting you know everything up front, which is actually really, really cool, but does kind of limit the, uh, as a content creator, what I can really drop on an hourly basis. But let's see, Blitz Clutch Pack is 700. So guys, you're gonna need a lot of master tokens. You do need, wow, you're gonna need 125 for Lamar Jackson. So you're gonna have to get, like, let's say you just open up straight uh, Blitz Clutch Packs. Let's go with Legend Fans Packs. I don't know how, how valid that really is there. Let's see, Blitz Bowls players. So for him, you get 3,000, you get 17. So let's say you needed 125 divided by 17 times that by 3,100. So it seems like it would cost 22,794 blitz, blitz tokens or blitz bolts, I should say, to get enough mass tickets, which doesn't actually seem that horrible, quite honestly, but I don't know the exact conversion of uh, blitz uh, bolts yet and how exact much they exactly cost. So can't exactly go over that. Now there's still plenty in the store. Pretty much the whole blitz, the whole blitz promo is the store. So we gotta definitely stay here. It goes all the way up to Blitz Metropolis packs, all pro packs, Blitz 8788 pack, veteran pack, 
Let's see, NFL Fantasy 100 pack, Blitz Clutch pack, Most Favorite pack, Blitz Legend Fantasy pack, Blitz Game Changer pack, Blitz Team of the Week pack, Blitz Heavyweights pack, I'm, I'm hoping there's a power pass over here, Blitz Elite Player pack, Blitz Harvest pack, Blitz All Pro pack, Blitz Game Changer pack, it's a mouthful, Blitz Flashback pack, Blitz Color Rush pack, Blitz NFL Fantasy pack, Blitz Gold Premium pack, and the, obviously the uniform. So out of all these, none of these packs really entice, I'm not much of a pack guy to be honest with you guys. If I have certain leftover things, I do want to build up enough tickets to make Lamar Jackson at some point. Now, Lamar will not be on the block probably for quite a while because people actually have to get them done. Now, at the moment, you can only get about 17 plus 6. That's 23. You can get these packs right, this pack right here. So that's like another, you can probably get another 12. It looks like you can only get up to like 30 right now. You really can't get many. So it appears that you will not be able to get them day one. I could be entirely wrong, but if my math stands correct here, you're not going to be able to get Lamar to like the third day. So I'm going to show you guys the stats over on Mudhead, obviously. Now, let's see if the solos are available. Because there should be some solos and some solo house rules that should be available for us to play at some point. Here we go. Blitz solos are available. Milestones up to 100. Let's see how many Blitz bolts we could potentially get from this. And it's freezing. Cool. All right. It's not showing us. But let's see. Blitz 101. Up to 1,000 Blitz bolts. So if we're going to get at least like 10,000 from solos, house rules, and everything, this might not be that bad. Because if you could potentially get all of that and you save it all up, you might only have to buy about half back to get enough for... Not Blitz bolts. I mean... Ooh. Yeah, you're gonna need like 22,000 blitz bolts. So you're gonna have to get uh, that's for the 125 um, master tickets. So you're gonna need quite a few blitz bolts. But obviously, I'll have plenty of video guys, videos for you guys tomorrow going over how many you need, what's the conversion rate, so you guys can properly get Lamar, one of those guys, for pretty cheap. So if you go into Blitz 101, this is kind of like the house rules. So quick slant. Sometimes the best way to counter blitz is to leave the extra rusher unblocked and pass as quickly as you can to your uncovered receiver. So complete five more passes in one drive, do not pass. So these are just objective based solos. Get these done. The more stars you play, the more blitz you bolt. That's how you get your blitz bolts. You need at least three, plus the extra coins you get. So it's really not a bad deal right there. And then let's see what else we got going on here. So there was supposed to be like a, this is supposed to, I guess, be the house rules. So it says minus three downs, minus three 15 yards per down, minus or plus one point on completion, minus one point on rush, take three points on sack, no special team. So that's kind of like the rules you have to play in these. So I recommend you guys get those done for your blitz bolts and for your coins. And obviously you want to be saving those because Lamar Jackson and Christian Johnson are going to be beastly. I wonder what Christian Johnson's speed is because if he's faster than Barry Sanders, it's really going to suck because he's just invested in him. Now let's see if they got the Blitz online house rules out yet. And it does not appear so yet, but again, the rewards for that is probably just going to be more Blitz bolts. I'll probably end up dropping... No, Blitz is this weekend. I don't know when they'll end up dropping. Maybe they'll drop that tomorrow at 10.30. I do not see it yet. It could just be a delayed drop. But for time being, I'm not seeing it, but that's more than okay. So, so far what it's looking like is you cannot get the Masters yet. You cannot get quite a few things yet, but you at least know everything. There's no surprises this year, which is kind of cool because, like, you know, if you're a father, you work or anything, maybe, like, because last year, you know what really sucked, to be honest with you guys, is like this. So you waited all day for these cards to finally be out. You skipped work, you skipped your class, whatever, and then it was, like, a gridiron pack. And, like, wow, I wasted all that time for that. But now, at least, you guys know in advance what is what, and you guys know, like, okay, I'm going to be home for that, which helps a lot of people out, in my opinion. Now, 86 overall, Marquise Brown, 95 speed. I did read about that. If he gets down cheap enough, he will be a budget beast with that 95 speed. Kemmed up on, our, on a Ravens team team, this guy's going to get, like, a 99 speed, guys. That could be pretty, pretty crazy. Now, there's also Mark Andrews, Trace Vinovich, Marquise Brown. Now, so I'm going to go check out Mudhead real quick to see if, that, if the cards are up. All right, guys, so the stats are over on Twitter. We got Josh Allen, Jalen Smith, Robbie Anderson, Dalvin Cook, Justin Reed, and Lane Johnson. Now, Josh Allen's got great speed, 85 speed, 87 excel, 87 tackle, 87 play rec, 80 block shed, 86 finesse, move, 81 strength. Card's decent, not good enough of a pass rusher or a block shedder, to be honest, to be on my team. But great athleticism. Jalen Smith, 87 speed, 91 excel, 85 tackle, 87 play rec, 92 hit power, 84 zone. Very solid user card. Powered up in Canada. This card's going to be one of the best user linebackers in the game. Great standalone zone. Kind of like Ryan. He's kind of like Ryan Shazier in a sense. Great card. Robbie Anderson, 91. 93 speed. 85 jumping. 90 catching. 84 catching traffic. 90 spec catch. 86 short route running. 86 medium route running. And 90 deep route running. Great route running. Pretty great catching. Great speed. Really well-rounded card. Now, Lane Johnson's a guy I'm kind of excited for. 87 strength. 94 awareness. 89 pass block. 90 pass block power. 88 pass block finesse. 89 run block, 88 run block power, and 88 run block finesse. I'll probably scoop this card and power him up. I do have Elaine Johnson ready there, so I might as well just power him all the way. This card's going to be a great right tackle, chemmed up. Justin Reed, 91 speed, 90 excel, an 89 play rec, 87 pursuit, 82 man, 90 zone, 80 hit power. Pretty great card. Great zone, great speed, great excel, good height, decent hit power, good play rec. Pretty great free safety. Would I upgrade him oh, as an upgrade over 
Brian Dawkins, maybe not, but still great. Dalvin Cook, 92 overall halfback, 90 speed, 91 excel, 93 agility, 88 carrying, 66 catching, 88 elusiveness, 75 trucking, 90 break tackle. This card's an L, in my opinion. His last card already had like an 89 speed, and with doubt with uh, Jim Brown, Dickerson, Barry Sanders, and Emma uh, and Smith in the game. Dalvin Cook's kind of an L, not a fan of that card. Was kind of excited for him, thought he'd be a little bit better. Well, guys, for the first master, we got Lamar Jackson, 93 overall, guys. Super hyped for this card. Six foot two, 92 speed, 88 throw power, 88 throw, 89 throw short, 85 throw mid, 86 throw deep, 93 throw under pressure, 91 throw on the run, and 90 play action. So powered up and chemed up, guys. He's gonna have like a 93 speed, 90 throw power above, 90 shorter above, a, almost 90 mid range. <laughs> he should get a 90 throw deep with go deep and chemed up. Really high throw to pressure. He should get, I think, dashing dead eye or roaming dead eye, which is amazing. He's going to have 91 or above throw on the run and above 90 players. This card's going to be the best quarterback in the game. Hands down, he's going to get roaming or dashing dead eye more than likely. And he's going to have escape artist. And he's going to be this fast with crazy juke, crazy spin. This Lamar's going to break the game, guys. Super hyped for this card. we got to see the intangibles, obviously, but he probably won't be as a full card on this game for quite a few days until they give us enough opportunities for master tickets. But this card looks beastly, guys. Definitely going to scoop this as soon as I can. going to be crazy expensive, though. Next, we got Chris Johnson. 94 overall halfback for the Tennessee Titans. He starts with a 94 speed. Wow. Wow, this card's crazy fast. I mean, it makes kind of rethink Barry a little bit. He's got 94 speed, 94 excel, CJ 2K, 93 agility, 89 carrying, 72 catching, 93 looseness, 46 trucking, 88 break tackle. Now, break tackle sucks a little bit. I'm kind of used to that good break tackle. I mean, although obviously with speed and all, he's only going to get like a 95 powered up and then on the right team, maybe like 96, 97. Barry can obviously get that high too. Probably rather stick with Barry just for the fact that Barry has way better break tackling, better agility, better excel. But this CJ 2K is definitely the fastest card, fastest running back in the game. Crazy good card. But I think I'd still rather have Eric Dickerson or Barry Sanders just because the trucking, break tackle, agility, and excel is really going to be felt, especially the break tackle because like Barry's fast, right? But what makes Barry different is that he can also get bumped into like a pinball and break off things. If Chris Johnson just straight line speed with pursuit angles this year, it's really not going to help too much. But guys, that is about it for this video. Let's head over to the Madden screen to close this out. All right, guys, that is about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn that on, you boys. Come join the family. We had so much to go over. Sorry if I missed anything, guys. Trying to get this up for you guys. I don't think I really missed much. Some things aren't exactly out. But on the bright side, you guys do know all the offers that will be available for you guys. So luckily, there's going to be not many surprises. You guys know exactly what's coming out for you guys. But that is about it for the video. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, turn the notification bell, come join the family. Let's see how, if we can get to 14,000 by the end of this week. Comment down below what you think of the promo and the masters, and make sure to smash the like button. Can we get half a thousand likes as soon as possible, boys? Start smashing now. I'm out. Enjoy the rest of your Thanksgiving. Peace.